Hey guys, what's going on? This is our same here, and I'm bringing you more Witcher 2. So let's continue, shall we? Uh, last time we actually kinda escaped uh, from this place. I mean, at least we started our escaping, so now we are gonna continue and hopefully without fails. I just woke up though, so I'm still kinda sleepy, although uh, I have some work to do today, so. So I really want to finish this before I actually uh, start anything today. So hopefully we are gonna do fine. What was that? By the way, as always, guys, thank you for all support so far. Okay, this guy is coming. Oh, stun! Oh, yeah, 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 we're not gonna kill anyone here because these are basically good soldiers, kinda. Leave me be. Let me okay, me. let's see. I don't really remember this part of the game. Okay, one guy there. What if we go? Oh god, he's he's following me basically. Just you and me. Not very romantic, I'll admit, but he might stay down there. Don't touch me, you monster! I knew you'd like me. And remember, that worked. That actually worked. Rusty key. Can we actually open this? Nah, I don't think so. No, I'm not gonna do that. Yeah, it's probably night locked, so it's got to be somewhere down there. Yeah. Wait, was that a key? No, it wasn't a key. <laughs> Okay, so let's see, can we actually do this without fails? Ooh, that was close. Oh okay, yeah, that just fell. Um, how I'm dealing with this? Oh. Nah, that's, that's not good, that's not good. Ah. Wait, is there like... Yeah, there is actually a quick load button, so... Well, we did failed. I didn't expect that he's gonna turn around so quickly. That was kind of surprising. Did he? Wow, he saw me. Wow. Hmm. I don't know why I'm failing now. Desk job back. Okay, we're gonna wait for him to turn around. That worked. All right, this time. Let's see it. You deaf or what? I said a prisoner's escaped! Guards! Where the hell is everyone? Guards! Over here! God. Wow, that was close. Oh, that was freaking close. Okay, we're gonna hide from... Nah, we're not gonna hide. I'm gonna just open this. We can't. I swear on my mother's life, it was there a minute ago. I'll show you, scum. Flat that tongue of yours again and I'll rip it out. I think that we need to keep from that guy. That's gonna be the case, most likely. Can he see me here? He can't, but... Okay, it's cool. Kinda close, still okay. 
upper dungeon key I think it is so, so it's gonna be... Oh, here! Ooh. Shilad Fitz Esteban, emissary of the Empire of Nilfgaard and its most divine emperor, Emir Var Emrys. What do you want of me, Nilfgaardian? Simply to speak, my lady. Ah, really? Something you would not dare were my son still alive. I very much regret the death of the Baron Lavalette. Please accept my deepest condolences. Yet it is precisely his loss that renders our conversation mutually desirable. Let go of me. I shall walk unaided. I shall return, rogue! And I shall repay you. Let us go, my lady. Your cries can do us no good. Okay. Oh, wow, I didn't actually expect that. Okay, so he's kind of with us, or he's working for... I'm always forgetting his name. Borg? Something like that. Okay, so I should be following them, correct? Yeah. Okay, that didn't work. Hmm, that didn't work at all. I I don't know what the fuck I expected actually, but I didn't expect them to wait there. So I'm gonna need to do something about them. Most likely to make diversion or something. I doubt that I can go here. Peak. Oh, it's uh, solitary, I think. Okay, so... Hmm... Should I pick here? As I can't pick, really. Yeah, so... You're hard. The point is not to tomorrow. Sorry, I'm in a hurry. You'll see me today. Yeah, I can't go through those doors. What the fuck? I can't go through doors. He's... wow. I'm missing something. I'm definitely missing something. I don't know why and how. Maybe first door on the left. Maybe first door on the left actually can do some... thing. Let's see. Now it's gonna be first door on the right. This one perhaps. Yeah, actually, yeah. Oh, God. He saw me, of course. Of course. And I'm dead. Oh, this is now getting really annoying. I know that he's gonna turn around. I know. I didn't really... Here. I kinda didn't care. Okay, where the fuck is he? Hmm. God, he's going here. Why the hell is he going here? He's gonna turn around now, right? Yeah, he's gonna turn around now. Oh, you fucker. 
I know that this need to be stealth approach and so on, but I kind of fucked up, so I want to see the map actually, at least. Yeah, we're gonna need to kill them, so mm, or to stun them at least, because we will need a key, I believe. So I need to do this quickly. We're gonna quick save, and there is a guy here. Okay, now we need to deal with that guy. But we're gonna have this one here. And he should be down. There we go. Okay, that could have been done much, much earlier without any problems, but it's locked. Maybe one of those guards actually do have a key or we just need to go this on this door actually. <clears throat> yep. Come in, Master Geralt. Allow me to introduce the Baroness Lavalette, mother to the royal children, who at present mourns the passing of her eldest son, a lady. I comfort the Baroness with assurances that House Lavalette needs suffer no more. Its future brighter as it stands protected by the Empire of Nilfgaard. Did you kill my son, Arya? Well, this is gonna be hard to justify, I guess. <laughs> I had no choice. He knew what can happen once swords are drawn and begin to swing. He chose death over shame. Stubborn like his father and grandfather before him. Honor above all. How did he die? Did he suffer? No. I doubt he felt the final blow. Didn't even see it coming. There's that, I suppose. Milady, I killed many during the assault, not just your son. War demands sacrifices. You might remember that the next time you're about to start one. Have some compassion, Master Geralt. The Baroness requires support. She is distraught as it is. Unnecessary toil, Excellency, for witches have no feelings. And the truth, especially when painful, can wake us from the slumber of self-deception. I deserved as much. Milady, I wouldn't trust the Ambassador if I were you. Master Geralt, let us be serious, please. Let him speak. I wish to hear this. I didn't hmm. know your son. But I know he saw the Empire as a foe, as did King Foltest. You've no notion of the events transpiring in the Kingdom. Of what Kimbold, Maraval and their ilk are capable. My duty is to Foltest's children, their safety. And though I too see a pact with Nilfgaard as a pact with the Devil, I feel I have no choice. Besides, can you say that you really knew the King? Well enough to be confident of my words. Truly? In that case, what kind of a man was he? I wish to know your view. Well, he was stout and ruthless. He was like any other man except born to wear a crown. I'm not one to judge. He used everything and everyone. I would say this. He was ruthless, hard and effective. A good king. Effectiveness is the mark of a good witcher. We've learned to expect other things from monarchs, say, justice and wisdom. Few are born wise, my lady. He did all he could to preserve and safeguard the realm. The ambassador questioned your guilt. It seems now that I too believe you did not slay the king. Your Excellency, you will aid the Witcher to escape the castle. That is my wish. But, my lady, this would represent an immeasurable risk in my estimation. And there is the matter of your son. He chose his fate, and departed in a manner worthy of the Lavalettes. How am I to believe you'll protect me from reptiles like Kimbolt and Maravel when you balk at the notion of deceiving a few prison guards? Milady, I shall do what is in my power. 
Give me a moment, Witcher, then proceed to the main gate. I don't know how is she going so easily over the fact that they killed her son and suddenly he believes me, she actually believes me, and she wanna make sure that I escape, like, what? Oh, I need to wait, I think. Or we're gonna just follow him. God! The witch has fled his cell and is raging in the dungeon. Restrain him immediately. But... One more word, soldier, and I shall personally make certain you hang beside the fugitive. To the dungeon, on the double. Okay, that worked. Or it's gonna work. Come on. What about those bodies, though? Ah, uh, they're just sleeping around. <laughs> okay... Is this actual escape or we are still going through the castle? Or for or whatever the it is. Reach the river boat. Huh, I guess we are finally outside. I never actually played this game on smooth 60 FPS. Uh, in city at least. Uh, so this is the first time that actually I'm doing this and I'm so kinda amazed. So I'm gonna enjoy this by a lot. Yeah, I expected I can go there actually. But you know. <laughs> don't, don't question me. I just want to make sure. Okay, they're gonna follow me though. Ouch! What the hell is range of that sword? Nah, I think that we need to... To run like this? To be able to escape? Yeah, there is no way that I could actually go... Yeah, that needed to happen. Uh, level up. Wait, where the hell was level up? There we go. So, it's still pet locked. It's locked. Okay, then we're gonna go with this. We could upgrade um, this because we're gonna need a lot of HP. Vigor regeneration. There we go. While I out of combat. Unlocks the ability to throw daggers. I'm not gonna need that. <clears throat> ability to parry blows from all directions. That's gonna be handy. Redirect arrows. And during combat. That's gonna be handy. So, we kinda need to go with this one. Just to get that regeneration. And then I'm gonna level up again vitality. And then for less time, this one. That's the plan. Okay, they're gonna die, I can't really do anything here. Uh, I guess I should be waiting for that fight to end. There we go. We Gucci? I think so. Yeah, it was... I'm impressed. The boys were betting you'd turn the dungeon into another Blaviken. Can we sail? That peace and quiet might disappear irretrievably at any moment. Triss, is everything all right? Not exactly. I'm no longer the royal advisor. I've lost my post, my home in Vizima. Witcher's mistress, they call me. Kingslayer's whore. Wow. People say what they think they have to. I know, but... They'll change their minds as soon as we find the Kingslayer. Roach will see to that. Right, spy? I'm no spy. But you're mostly correct. An interregnum is chaos by definition. Rats like Baron Kimbolt and Count Maravel ruled Temeria now, or strived. But no one save old Natalis can restore true order. Natalis is far away and of low birth. The crown's simply out of his reach. Baron Kimbolt, on the other hand. Politics is secondary right now. Vernon, learn anything new about the Kingslayer? A week ago, I got a message from an informer in Flotsam. He saw Yorveth in the company of a large, bald man, not unlike the one you described. A week ago? Sounds like a cold trail to me. We need to start somewhere. The trading post is a few days upriver, in the forests that lie on the Adernian border. Yorveth's territory. Flotsam it is, then. 
Atreus. Yes. I'm a bit beat up. Do you look at my wounds? Mm -hmm. Let's go below deck. And I need you to tell me about Yennefer in detail. I want to hear it all, even the things you don't want to tell me, even the things that might hurt. Okay. Got a cast off. Clear the lines and all aboard. Lines clear, Captain. Oh, she's here as well. I don't know why though. I mean, why would be that interesting? Why would that be interesting? War is a good time to forge friendships, alliances. <laughs> Harry and Lavalette, busy building walls and forging swords for Gotham. When he was gone, those he loved were forced to forge friendships with those he hated. I don't know what was that. Life can't be easy for anyone who's unlucky enough to be labeled a regicide. That goes triple for someone like Geralt. Could his luck get any worse? I've known the Witcher for a long time, and I'm sure that kings, courts, and politics concern him about as much as last year's snow. But hey, life doesn't always dole out what we expect, right? Sometimes it even forces us to associate with unsavory characters like Vernon Roach. No, I'm not making any excuses. And yes, I had my reasons. The Witcher spent most of the way to Flotsam talking to someone. Long into the evening, as water lapped against the boat's side, Triss told him forgotten stories of his unexpected child and his toxic relationship with a sorceress named Yennefer. Stories of a life stolen from him. That art is so you? cool. Don't set this tale aside. Give me just a few minutes more, for someone special is about to appear in dire straits upon a scaffold. That tart was so cool. You can't really say is that actually 3D or it's just pure art with some effects around. I love that. Okay, elves. Yeah, they are elves. Holy fuck, that was like <laughs> one mile away. Okay, that was freaking weird. Sheathe your sword, elf. I'm here to talk. Is this that the big guy? Yeah, it is. Bow low. You stand before a head crowned. That of Demavend, King of Eder, by the grace of the gods, sovereign of the Pontar Valley, and so on. And you are. A friend to non-humans. I have an offer. Speak quickly and to the point. The Arrakis will soon return, and I'd rather know all before then. 
I can add several more heads to this one. Each crown. Fold S to start with. I barely escaped in Edda. I'll need help. Access to your hideouts and maps of your secret trails. And the support of the Scoyatel. I want no gold and have no interest in the killer's fame. Then why do you wish them dead? It's a long story. Your beast nabbed his neck. Time to go. You know, when you think about that, this big guy is more scarier about facts that he's doing that for nothing, at least from what we know, instead how he looks, at least, so far. So, he's scary. Oh god, I can't wait for Witcher 3. I don't know, if you don't finish Witcher 2 before Witcher 3, I think that we're gonna go after Witcher 3. But I really want to finish. We have like eight days to finish that. Clotson should be just know. beyond the point. We'll take the beach. Who's we? You and me. Reconnaissance. I'm coming too. You should stay behind. We can't be sure of the reception we'll get. Precisely why I won't let you go alone. Someone's got to look after you. That time of the month. Okay. I really want to change his outfit, though. I don't. I don't like that. Any news from your secret? I don't know. The port's blocked. Some merchants are being held up for months. What about roads through the forest? Wait, what? Your vest rules the forest. What? I'm not sure. Can we take those? We can. Wait, that was diagram for Witcher Silver Sword. What? Hmm. Witcher Silver Sword, indeed. Nah, I didn't really wanna. Yeah, this is what we need. We need one more diamond dust. No, we have that actually. We need silver ore. Okay, I don't know will that help us because don't remember actually that there was any item in the beginning. Where are we? In a forest. Very funny. But who does it belong to? Your vet, maybe? I know more about the Pontar Valley than you think. For instance, I know that Foltest stole this land from Demavend a few years back. I believe you had a hand in that. 